Adam 22 had on Danny Mullen. And uh, they gave Brendan Schaub a trashing. So I'm going to play this and give you my thoughts on it. Uh, it started out with um, Adam explaining how him getting his wife, Lena, a Lamborghini was just a skit. And they went to a car rental place. So the topic of expensive sports cars came up. And oh boy, they know a comedian who likes to drive one. So let's go ahead and see what they had to say about it. And I are not Lambo guys. We, uh, I did sit in that thing and it felt pretty good though. Dude, it's just, it's trying so hard. Like, I yeah. respect that about you, that you drive a nice car and Lena drives a nice car. But like I, I a reasonably my... nice car, not a $300,000 car. My exactly. car is like a $110,000 car that exactly. I lease. Yeah. It's, in my mind, the highest I'll go in terms of car quality is like a Porsche, uh -huh. like a, a base model Porsche. My problem is I don't know anything about cars, so I, I lack the ability to want for a nice car because I just don't even know what they what they are. I don't know what they're about. You said a Porsche. I could not point out a Porsche to you on the street. That's I like that about you. I don't know. You're dressed like a guy who doesn't know what a Porsche is right now. Again, to come back to this. But, it never really made sense to me. I don't get the car thing. But, so the Ferraris, here's my take on Ferraris. And you and I had a chuckle privately behind the scenes about a comedian who drives a Ferrari recently. Did we? We did. But hmm. the thing with Ferraris is, A, you can't drive them in Los Angeles because the road maintenance is so poor. Hmm. You can, but it's going to cost $10,000 to fix the body every time you hit a pothole. Seriously? Uh, yes. Uh, secondly, just when you pull up anywhere in a Ferrari, uh, it, it just screams. I don't like the phrase little dick energy uh -huh. because it's usually co-opted by fat left-wing women to shame right. men. And uh, to them, I say, like, why can't I start using the phrase fat girl energy? To I'm, me, I'm going to popularize that. If I was, I feel like I could understand the car thing a lot more if I wasn't me because when I... Like, I feel like I'm an okay-looking guy. I feel very comfortable with my financial status, and I feel like a lot of people know who I am. And I feel like a lot of guys who drive super nice cars, they're nothing much to look at. Yeah. They are not famous at all. Yeah. Nobody is ever going to notice them. So, yeah. like, they, they go to Earth Cafe or they go to a nice restaurant or yeah, whatever. Yeah. Nobody's ever going to notice them. When I, I, I go and take an Uber to a fucking nice restaurant or whatever – I can usually count on like some percentage of people looking at me and, and the fucking waiters knowing who I am and shit like that. And I don't really like crave that at all, but it's also kind of like just built in. Like I, I just am recognizable enough that a certain percentage of people are going to know who I am. If you're like an anonymous businessman yeah. and you've got $10 million in the bank, you start thinking, how am I going to present myself sure. in such a way that people. Okay. So when Danny Mullen said, we were laughing behind the scenes at a comedian who drives a Ferrari. You know they're talking about Brendan Schaub. I think Brendan Schaub is the only comedian who drives a Ferrari, and they know Brendan Schaub. And he showed up to do Adam's show in a, in a Ferrari. So, <laughs> And, of course, everyone just makes fun of Brendan Schaub about everything. And you have to remember, I think the last Ferrari purchase was the one where um, – his dad had to fly in and sign the lease for it or co-sign for it. But, I mean, everything they said about the car topic was spot on. Obviously, they were talking about Brendan Schaub and uh, ugh, had him 22. I mean, yeah, the stuff with his wife and that Jason Love guy. I was listening to Joe Budden's podcast today and Ish was going off on him about uh, starting beef with, between black people and stuff. But uh, yeah, the Brendan Shaw thing, obvious who they were talking about. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments.